and they're off and racing and Savannah Domino has bombed out the boxes with Chelm's Tornado for company up. In behind these then comes Savannah King as they make their way around the first two turns. It is Chelm's Tornado that's got on the youngster for John Mullins. Has a two length lead over Savannah Domino trying to make a race of it staying on his get with the times. Round the last two turns is Chelm's Tornado trying to fend off the attentions of get with the times who's swooping round the outside. Get with the times. He's got to get up. A strong running performance, close for second between Chelm's Prince and Savannah King. Well, after race three, I'm joined by David Alcock, who trains and owns Get With The Times, who has bought at the Toaster Stale here just a matter of weeks ago. And here she is winning a race on Derby final night. It's a lovely story, David, because you just have one dog and one bitch, and I was with you when you, when you bought her, and look at you now. I remember you saying to me, uh, what, we, what are you going to do with her? Well, this is what I'm going to do with her. I mean, it, she's only had, what, six races in her life. Uh, she's won a little, uh, won her first two opens at uh, Central Park. Second to the track record holder here tonight, over six, four, two. Run a bit flat last week, but we had her checked out, and uh, obviously she's right. Absolutely, she's right. And uh, we featured you in the RPG CPs we did on Greyhound Train, though. It's a really nice story to follow. What are your plans with that now, then? Um, we're probably going to Brighton for the uh, Regency, probably. Um, all being well, that she's fit and well. Uh, yeah, Regency. And then on to Monmore after that, over to the 6.30. Competition there, but uh, you were bargaining hard on your phone the other day, but it looks like you got a bit of a bargain in the, in the end. Oh, well, yeah, I mean, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. from the minute I was uh, when she actually tried, I think I told you on the on that day, I said, I really like the line she runs in the program tonight. They said it would be a problem, but it is a problem sometimes. But nine times out of ten, she misses trouble, you know. But she goes right sometimes. I mean, when, when she's short headed second to Shakira at Central Park. There was a two of them running on their own together. Uh, it was probably a rain a bit wide that cost her the race there. But I'd soon have a bitch that runs her line because nine out of ten races, she'll be out of trouble. She's done you really proud tonight. Well done. Congratulations.